with regard to this chart, the red is now interest, it's not debt. And I'm comparing in this chart the defense budget, remember what our chairman of our Joint Chiefs said, and our non-defense budget. This is what we vote on every year. And the blue again is national defense and the green is everything else or non-defense. The reason I put this up there is everybody in this room knows what interest does in your personal or your community or your business budgets. This is showing you what interest is doing in our federal budget. And you can see the line. Interest is the fastest growing part of the entire United States government budget. And today, in this year, it's about 250 billion. That number there, that little red number, red line, is about 250 billion dollars. If you had a debt that was doing this to your interest, just the interest cost that you were paying, I think you'd agree that you had a problem. Look at 2023, interest will be higher than our entire national defense budget and higher than our entire non-defense budget. And I actually think that these charts are wrong because these char this chart show, assumes that we'll be able to keep the green and blue lines at the projected level that Congress would like to keep them at for the next decade. And I don't think we can keep them there with interest doing this. And so I actually believe that the reality we face is that our defense budget will shrink and our non-defense budget will shrink and the red will eclipse it sooner which to me just shows uh, a, a way of showing on a chart what our chairman of our Joint Chiefs was talking about. I'm Mike Crapo, and I approve this message.